Hello everybody, today we talk about some simple physical problem. This problem involves Newton's second law. So let's read the problem. A box is hung with a spring from the ceiling of an elevator that is accelerating downward. The elevator passes 5 meters in first 2 seconds. The stretch of a spring is 1.5 centimeters. The spring constant is 100 newtons per meter. What is the mass of the box? So, uh, first of all, let's determine the acceleration. We know that the elevator passes 5 meters in first 2 seconds. And we also assume that um, the elevator was initially at rest. So, we can use the following formula to determine the acceleration. Where S is a distance the elevator travels, T is the time of its motion and A is the acceleration. So, the acceleration should be equal to double S divided by T squared. Now we just plug in the numbers and we get the result. The acceleration equals 2.5 meters per second squared. And now let's draw all the forces acting on the box. There are two forces. The gravitational force acts in downward direction and the hook's force acts in upward direction. When the elevator starts moving, the oscillations of this box occur. But these oscillations dumps very fast. And after that, the acceleration of this box becomes the same as that of the elevator. Let's point the y-axis in downward direction. According to the Newton's second law, we can write that mg minus Hooke's force is equal to m multiplied by a, uh, where the m is the mass of the box. Uh, but the Hooke's force is equal to k multiplied by x, where k is a spring constant or a force constant, and x is the extension of the spring. So, we obtain that m is equal to a kx divided by g minus a. Now we just plug in the numbers and we get the result. The mass of the box is equal to 0 0.2 kilograms. That's the answer. Thank you for watching and goodbye.